All right, decaling process has begun. As you can see, I've got the decal set down on that big, long, dark marker. That should, if it works the way it normally does, smooth out in a few minutes and look almost painted on. Big change from for this model from the standard markings is the addition of these winged bleeding Jedi emblems, which gentlemen on the uh, Deviant Art galleries by the name of First Mage Lord did up. I used them on the uh, Lady Revan. The black markings were originally dark red, like the standard Republic markings, but I darkened them on my computer and then printed them on the blank decal sheet to give the dark look I wanted for the Intimidator. All right, continuing progress on decaling the Intimidator. Got the main markings on the body now. Got the decal set down. Hopefully get her to suck down a little better. But, as you can see, all our black markings are down now. Once I get the uh, decal set up, it'll be time to reseal it and get some work done on weathering her. Bit of an update. As you can see, the stripes are down. Looking pretty good as far as that part goes. But, if you get in closer here, I'm trying to get a good angle on it, you can see that issue I've had in the past of my custom decals rolling up on me has reared its ugly head again. I'm debating right now if I want to go through the effort of stripping the decals off and redoing it, or if I want to just see what I can do about getting the, the roll part off and then go through fig go through and weather the model wish me luck